Welcome to the Texas Go Radio Show. I'm your host, Metorius. This is part 16 of the 1744 live stream by Owen. I swear to God, I'm not gay, Benjamin. You know about the Bible. You know about uh, the message. And you still live that way? It's literally worse. Fuente's pushing jerk off pretty hard. Guess they're all fake and gay. Uh, well, everyone's on a spectrum of fake and gay, I think. Like, it's like... Uh, like, I'm not here to, to, like, get in beefs. And- One of the aspects that I do want to agree with him about right now is that if you are preaching the gospel, if you are uh, pretending to be something that you're not, you are held to a higher standard than other people. You will be judged more harshly. If you're pretending to be something that you are not, Owen Benjamin, then you will be held uh, accountable for what you're doing. And that's one of the reasons why he keeps trying to say, I'm not a Christian, even though he's portrayed himself to be a Christian for the last three years, four years, five years, six years. Mercy and grace is important. Mercy triumphs over judgment. That is true. I believe that to be a a truth. Mercy does triumph over judgment battles and shit like i did overreact to fuentes and i did apologize to him and i mean it you know i don't approve but (laughs) having said that somebody that does do the damage that they do and they being owen benjamin the storm of accountability is here it is and it's coming And he hurts people. I don't know if it's intentional. I can't say that. But is it there? Is his... Do do his actions hurt people? Yes, they do. My hand is up. My right hand is up. And I'm saying yes. His actions do hurt people. Yes. Yes. He is a manipulative, predatorial cult leader who is also dangerous and despicable. Move of his uh, lifestyle choices or, uh, you know, the whole Catholic thing. But All right, I'm going to calm down. I apologize. I do. I heard something or I read something or somebody told me something and it was along the lines of even the executioner can be respectful to the person they're executing. You don't have to be derogatory. You don't have to be blasphemous. You don't have to be evil whenever you're passing judgment. You don't have to because that's what I'm doing. I am passing judgment. Not condemnation. I'm not God. I will not declare that his soul is condemned to hell whatsoever. And I would encourage everybody else out there not to do that. But as far as passing judgment, (laughs) yes. Yes. (laughs) I might not say yes enough on this channel, but there's a reason for it. Pass judgment. Would you agree that you wouldn't allow him on your land? Yes. <laughs> would you would you would you agree that you wouldn't allow him around your children? Yes. Would you agree that him is Owen Benjamin? Yes. <laughs> yes. It's like when he said, "Well, we don't agree on everything." And I took that as a shot about the moon landing, which it was. I literally was like talking about how his dad's a fag and that I want to bury him under my fence. And uh He just said I was literally talking about how his dad was a and I wanted to bury him underneath my fence. And within the last hour and a half, he has already talked about somebody else referring to his dad, but they weren't even referring to him. This is one of the most convoluted, one of the most disgusting. Red flag. I am so 
I want to invite all of y'all into my barn, <laughs> in into my shed, into my uh, into my office, into my home. <laughs> I want to invite all, and let's just we can just talk about <laughs> it without with you know you know without what it is because you got to be. This is a buffet, man. I've worked in restaurants. I know how to cook food for specific people, and I know how to cook food for groups of people. This is a buffet. I might be getting tired of being buffet. Might I might be. That might be what I'm trying to learn right now. I have no idea. I don't know. And I'm kind of refusing to understand it right now. <laughs> I don't know if that makes sense, but yeah. And uh, that's way, like I was wrong. Like I was, the way I handled Fuentes was way overreactive. So. Well, that makes sense because the majority of everybody, I don't know Fuentes, what I've, what I do know about him, which is just the little tip of the iceberg, I'm going to say I don't like him. I'm just going to say that. I don't, there's, there wasn't enough that I saw that I was, uh, yeah, uh, he had, I'm attracted to him. I want to listen to what he has to say. No. But what I have read and from what I've understood from other people, Fuentes would have murdered this guy <laughs> in a debate of any caliber. And I've read multiple threads that just, I mean, I believe it. Oh, that's a, I, and I judge people based on my own set of morality. Like he was taking a shot at me about the fucking moon landing. I was drunk. My own set of morality. Owen Benjamin does not have a set of morality. He doesn't have a set of ethics. He doesn't have a set of morality. And I apologize for being so animated about this. That's getting old. On White Claw. And I was really, really pissed off about how everyone was acting about the fucking moon landing. One thing funny about Zerka liking Fuentes is that Fuentes rose to power. Zerka would be put in prison for his exploitation of women. Well, none of these guys are going to get, like, a lot of the World War II narrative. What about Owen's exploitation of women? Him disrespecting women. Him disrespecting almost every man he's ever came across. The real world, the internet, professional, it doesn't matter. He disrespects everyone. Are fictitious. They don't really get the goon squads ever like you think they do. Even like Duterte and shit. Like they'll get they'll get some death squads, but it's not it's not as scary as you think it is. Like you're never gonna see like one of these guys, I'm not gonna say never, but to convince three hundred million people to go along with like death squads is pretty much fucking impossible. You know, you're gonna like you'll see scary rhetoric and you'll see like some shit, but it's really not you're not gonna get uh you're not there's a there's a big difference between what I'm trying to say in this moment is what he's saying doesn't matter. You're not going to convince that many people. You probably won't. Now, is there a possibility? Sure, yeah. Nothing but possibilities. But <clears throat> there's a reason why Owen tries to say, oh, he's always said, I just want it down to the five. Well, he did say that while he had 5,000 people listening. And it was just fun and games for him. And then whenever it did get down to below 500, he was, oh, my, I mean, maybe I should just be nice to people. And that's what we're seeing right now. I've been animated over the last few videos, and I apologize for that. I, I, I do, honestly. I apologize. But it's, it's one of those things is you just don't you don't come across people like this in real life. You don't not in real life, because in real life, Owen doesn't exist. The Owen that we see does not exist. And so <laughs> possibly one of the reasons why I'm so animated and aggressive is because I'm dealing with real world problems. <laughs> you're, you're, I know how I deal with this. <laughs> Usually it's easy. It's easy to to just ignore <laughs> stupidity. But uh, I've thought about just walking away from this channel a couple times. I 
I have. Not for any other reason than... I've said what I think about Owen. There's so many different emotions. I can't keep up with the uh, the comments. I try to. But I feel bad. Because I don't want to just rush through it. And it's just one of those things. <clears throat> yeah, it's just one of those things. I try to rush through it. I don't want to rush through it. And so there I, I keep pushing it off. It's, there's a culmination coming and it's the, <laughs> it is the the uh, Bertaria festival of 2023 <laughs> is it is he showing up I don't know I think he's gonna say there's gonna be a, a not a health risk but a security risk I think is what he's gonna say anyways I I sincerely appreciate y'all watching these videos more what I appreciate more than y'all watching is y'all's uh, comments I do even though I haven't I'm going to though yeah I'm saying that right now my word I'm going to uh yeah. And the only other thing that I would ask is just liking it. Liking the, the videos that you see. If you if you feel as though you enjoy it or you think that it, there's some positivity in it or whatever, it's doing some good, like them. I don't enjoy asking you to like them. <laughs> but I, I, the only reason why I do is because there are channels that I watch and then whenever they remind me to like them, I'm like, oh, dude, I'm kind of, I feel bad for not. And I'll go back and like them or whatever. But yeah, no, it's important. I, I think that it's important. <laughs> I do. Or I wouldn't spend so much time doing these because this is my time. Me, my time. This is what I could be building boats with or whatever you want to, you know what I mean? Like wh whatever hobby. This is a hobby. This is. It's not a hobby. I feel like that was disrespectful. It's not a hobby. No. I think it's important. I do. Honestly do. Anyways. I'm not going to get anything scary out of these clowns. Maybe it was rough, but Big Bear's roasts are epic. Yeah, I enjoyed the uh, I enjoy the roast. No, but it's like, dude, threatening to kill somebody is bad. It's bad. It's not good. That is, I agree with that. Way to go for the universal truce of Owen Benjamin. <laughs> I'm like, what? <laughs> this is the same dude that said, whenever I give the nod, kill everyone. That's what he said. <laughs> I don't know. I'm. What is YouTube going to, are they going to give me strikes possibly? I hope not. This is commentary. I don't encourage anyone, anyone to hurt anyone. Yay is banned again or Owen is? Am I banned? Oh, how dare you guys? Is my Twitter banned? Oh, no, my Twitter's not banned. I'm still here, Codsworth. Still can't warm to Fuentes. No, I don't warm, I don't listen to Fuentes. Um, I don't... I, I think that uh, he's funny sometimes, but I don't... My apology isn't because I like him. It's because I was, wrong, I was way too aggressive. And he was, like, young. And I was, like, going fucking nuts. I was obviously he's trying to appeal to the most people possible. I don't appreciate not understanding why I'm so aggressive right now. I don't. It could be obvious to other people. It's one of the reasons why you should allow yourself to have conversations and be. Uh, you allow yourself to be presented as a uh, scrutiny or however you would say that 
scrutinize me, <laughs> make me better. However, that said, in a more respectful tone. I want to be nice. I do. I want to be nice. But you can't be nice always. And even all of the businesses that I've ran, all the people that I've fired, all of the things that I've done in my life, I still want to be nice. And that's not a testimony to me. You know, I'm not saying, no, no, that's a good thing. No, I'm, I'm self-analyzing right now. Which, should I be doing that? <laughs> no, probably not. Anyways. Going way too hard at the guy. I'm not telling you to like the guy. The guy says the only way to heaven is the Catholic Church. And that it's okay to say. I've never heard anyone say that. Ever. I've read, I've read, I mean, I haven't read a lot, but I've read certain things and I've never heard anybody, anybody, anyone ever say, Hey, come to me. We have the number one thing. Now, is that the uh, ortho? I have no idea. To be honest with you, I don't. Yeah. Well, there's that. And 15 year olds, your dick pic. If you have political power, like What? Coming from the dude that says there's no difference between a 15-year-old girl and a 35-year-old dude. This whole thing, man. Don't take anything what I'm saying right now for for uh, what it is. <laughs> I'm so... This, he's speaking so much crap. Yeah, no, don't listen. Don't watch these videos. <laughs> Just don't. This is stupid. I'm wasting my time. <laughs> this is the Texas Goat Radio Show. I'm your host, Victorious. As always, till next time.